Motorists are sometimes startled when they see this unusual-looking vehicle chugging along the English countryside near Cambridge. This noisy piece of automotive history is an 1884 Dédéon et Bouton and Trapardou personal steam kit. It's similar to the one sold by Christie's at its 2007 Retromobile auction. This particular vehicle is prized by collectors and historians. The Dédéon here is, is particularly um special in that uh, it was made before Daimler and Benz invented the petrol engine car. Um, Daimler and Benz both produced their vehicles in 1886 and um, the, the Dion steamer was made in 1884. Uh, I've been running the car now for 14 years and uh, I think even the most eminent of uh, historians uh, accept the fact that this is the oldest running car anywhere in the world. There's nothing older, and that is it, the oldest vehicle capable of running on the roads legally in the world. Like many early automakers, De Dion was surrounded by skeptics. Count de Dion in France, who was experimenting with steamers and then later internal combustion cars, was passionate about trying to develop this. His family, however, got injunctions against him because they saw him as being unstable, wasting his time and effort with these inventions that could amount to nothing. They were just toys, unstable toys of a little boy's mind. Whilst it's demanding to drive, uh, the fact that it goes as well as it does um, is really just a fantastic achievement. It's a real historical milestone that... Um, something, an inanimate object could be made to move in the way that, that it does. Count de Dion's autos proved to the world that cars really did work and might someday replace the horse. He probably would be surprised to see his little vehicle still running over 100 years later and even more surprised to learn that one similar to it just sold for nearly one million dollars.